there, everybody. Hope you're having a nice evening. Uh, as you can see, we're actually gonna play some Your Truck tonight. And uh, what we also is gonna do is probably prepare for a YouTube video as well. So apparently this stream is gonna be a YouTube video. I know that I'm always like, I'm always uh, putting out the VOD on YouTube uh, so that you guys can watch it later if you like. Or like watch back again. I don't know but that should, how you'd like to do this shit. But uh, yeah. Um, so as part of the stream, I plan for being a YouTube video. And what we're gonna do is we're gonna talk about, this is we're gonna play your truck. I'm a real trucker. I, I've never drove in, driven a real truck, but I'm something that I am fairly knowledgeable in. That's for the stream, like control panel, I would assume. But what I'm quite knowledgeable is to how to drive with a truck and trailer. So that is something that we're gonna talk about during the stream. Uh, that's actually just bullshit. I don't know. I don't need any of these. But yeah, okay. Cool. I think we have everything set up that we need. Microphone seems to be working. I have actually not sound checked this one. Uh, so I'm gonna do that real quick. But you, you guys are gonna say just as you are right now. Uh, there, there's no problems with that. Um, or um, output. output. And, and yeah, I can yeah, actually I can hear actually that, hear it's, that fucked it's fucked up. Fucked up. So we're so gonna check that real quick. Check that real quick. Monitor off. We're gonna go into sound settings. I don't really know why this happens. I, I would I imagine that it is because of uh, the sound card. And now it should be fixed. That, that should be everything that we need to do. So let's monitor again. And uh, hopefully this is... Yeah, now it works. Awesome! Haha! <laughs> uh, I, I should be... I should work as a technician. Oh god, no. No, fuck no. Uh, we, we should not run... run. We, we, I should not work as a technician, guys. That, that, is not, that is not something that should happen. Uh, BCR5KO. Welcome back! And uh, what's up? How are we doing tonight? Let's actually start up the game so we get can get going. Hope you're doing fine tonight. We're gonna have, uh, of course, as always, we have a nice cup of tea. We have some other drinks and beverages. Awesome. We're gonna get going with this. It's awesome to see you come back. I really appreciate that. Is the game too low? Or is the sound level okay? By the looks of it, the sound level should be... I got an A on that computer science test. Well, congratu congratulations! Well done! Computer science test. Uh, that, that sounds kind of hard. Actually. I, I've never really been too knowledgeable about computers. And we and we lost that football game. So, well, it's just one goal. You know what they say, you were a goalie, right? Just one goal, that's never the goalie's fault. You need your defenders to do their job, right? We are studying HTML5. Okay. Can you descri can you like uh, describe uh, the HTML5 more like in detail? I, I I'm not too sure that I know about what that is. Uh, let's get the control panel out and so that I can show you the actual game. And it's nice because we are actually gonna run uh, a manual truck tonight. So we're gonna 
the goal was is tap in. Oh, okay. That shit happens, I guess. You're gonna do better in the next game. HTML5 is used for making websites. Oh, okay. Oh, oh, yeah, right. Right. I, I sort of recognize what, like, the name of it, HTML5, isn't that like a coding uh, thingy? Something like that? Uh, but I didn't, I couldn't, like, place in my mind what, what it was. Uh, but yeah, we're, it seems like I don't, I'm not in a mission currently, so we're gonna choose a mission from the cargo map. Uh, Wingbig123, thank you for the follow and welcome to the stream. Uh, where are we? We we are in Lithuania, so we're gonna do to go to Irift. Holy shit, that's a. Okay, here are the short. Why did it change? I'm confused. Oh, yeah, okay. Holy shit. This is the sh No, it wasn't. Why doesn't that work? I did, I've turned it into... Uh, oh, yeah, right. Now, now I know what you mean. HTML5. Uh, I'm, I'm stupid. <laughs> uh, yeah, I haven't uh, updated that one. I usually update the joke uh, once a week. I should probably update it more often, though. Uh, but why, why doesn't this work? Um, uh, we're going to take a shorter mission because I, I think that shorter missions are more fun, but yeah, I actually need to increase the volume a little bit because this is very low. Maybe we should actually put on some music as well. Is that, is that something that we need to do? I don't really know. The music... Do, do you anybody in the chat know if uh, the uh, music in uh, this game is uh, copyrighted? I actually don't know about that. So we're in our wonderful full Scania uh, truck. Since I, since I am from Sweden, it... it uh, oh, I, I am not too knowledgeable of my... PC specs. I, I knew know that I'm uh, running AMD stuff, uh, but there are not like that good. I guess I think that my processor is in a level of uh, maybe a i5 from Intel Core. So uh, it, it is actually not. It's a working computer, and it's fine for the games I play, I guess. Uh, but I, I don't think it would uh, like be too good against uh, one of the newer games that are released. AMD Ryzen 5. It might be something like that. I have actually not. Oh, you have that one. I have no idea what processor I run. Maybe that is something that I can check. Uh, fuck, how am I gonna turn this around? I, I hate doing reversing from uh, uh, like to the right because when you're reversing from the left, you can actually look out like this. But when I am reversing it, to the right, I only have that mirror to look in, and that's kind of... Yeah, if I can check, I, I can check that real quick. I should actually put put something in the, down below in the stream, right? So that people can check the specs of the computer. Um, isn't it like something from the control panel that I can check that? Uh, system. I, it might be. Uh, about? Probably? How much have you paid for a PC? Oh, it was like 900 bucks, maybe. So, uh, okay. It's an AMD Ryzen 3, uh, 3100 4 core processor. Uh, and it's uh, 3.59 hertz, gigahertz. And uh, I have about 8 gigs of RAM. Don't know what brand of RAM I have. Can't see that from now. 
from here. Uh, and ob obviously it's a 64 bits uh, operating system. Uh, graphics card, I don't seem to be able to see from here though. Uh, but I have no idea. But uh, th this computer kind of needs an upgrade because uh, a Ryzen 3, that, that is a fairly low grade of a processor, I would imagine. But uh, I, I usually need my friends to check these kind of stuff because I'm not too knowledgeable myself in these kind of stuff. <clears throat> that, that's what you need friends for, right? So they can tell you the stuff that you don't know yourself. See if this is even going to work. I didn't pull forward enough, I think. So th this is ki kind of what we're going to talk about. Yeah, I can see straight away that I didn't pull forward enough. Oh, fucking hell. Ryzen 5, 16 gig gigabyte RAM. Uh, and a AMD Ryan, Ryan, Radeon uh, GPU. And an Asus uh, 320 motherboard. Yeah, I, I think that my motherboard is an Asus as well. Asus is good. Uh, I, I, I had a computer that I used for studying when, when I st studied uh, building engineering. Uh, and uh, that, that computer that I have back then was a Asus computer as well, but a laptop. I just love uh, 650 euros. Jesus, that's a that's a good deal, my friend. Did you like uh, upgrade anything yourself, or well, well since you you uh, are studying computer science, uh, I suppose you build the computer yourself, or did you like uh, buy a pre-built computer? So the reason why I'm in Bosnia that's expensive. Okay. Yeah, I, I guess you can, depending on where you live uh, and depending on taxes and kind, that kind of stuff, uh, it depends and you get more for your money. The insane part is I guess the, the reason why my computer was a lot lot more expensive and I didn't really get much better. Oh, you, you bought it pre-built. Uh, I, I guess that because of taxes or something. I, I don't really know how Sweden and Bosnia compares in uh, taxes. In Bosnia, the average salary is... 350 euros. Is that like a monthly salary or is it weekly salary or how does or how, or how does it work? A um, monthly? Oh god. Th then I I would imagine that you get quite quite a lot for your money in uh, Bosnia. My salary right now is like I guess you shouldn't talk salary too much, but a lot like I would get through a month if I got got like two two thousand euro. Uh, but actually in Sweden you you don't really get much for that kind of money, which which kind of sucks. This is actually kind of tough to turn around. I actually had a friend when I uh, were studying upper secondary uh, that were was from uh, Bosnia. She was actually really nice. I'm a student, so my salary is zero. Yeah. In Bosnia, do do you get like? Uh, some money from uh, the state for studying or 
Or, or do you like need a student loan for that kind of stuff? I, I know that when I study building engineer, I need, I needed a student loan. So, so that then I get got like maybe a thousand euro a month, but but then once again, you 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 didn't really get much for that money. I think that's kind of interesting to look the comparison comparison in uh, the world how a certain like amount of money you, you get so so different like amount of stuff for the same amount of money i think that's really an interesting like part part of it i am still in primary okay okay yeah yeah well uh, if you're in primary, we didn't, we didn't, uh, we, we didn't uh, get any money from the estate, uh, like when we were in primary as well. Damn, so you just 15. Actually, actually, when you said that you study like computer science, uh, I actually thought, thought that you were a lot older than you, than you were. That That's kind of interesting. Damn, you actually studied computer science in... Uh, uh, when you're 15, that's interesting. We did when I were in primary. Like I said, when with our school system, when I was 15, we would have we were in ninth grade. Uh, but and when I were in ninth grade, and seventh, eighth, and ninth grade, we we didn't have anything like computer science, which kind of sucks. Because uh, if I would have had that, I would have known a lot more about uh, computers and again, that kind of stuff. In Bosnia, there, are, there, there are primary nine years, high four years, and uh, college three to six years. Yeah, that that that's actually uh, that that's uh, fairly similar to. Uh, what we have over here in Sweden uh, our primary is actually 10 years uh, that first like uh, year we call year zero basically and uh, that that is more like kindergarten you play around and you start you, you tar start to look look at a little bit of math and writing and that kind of stuff uh, and then you go on to first grade and then everything gets harder and harder, obviously. Uh, and our, uh, I guess, comparison to high school or upper secondary, as I work call it, is uh, three years in Sweden. Uh, and uh, there I actually studied uh, nature science. So we studied biology, uh, chemistry and physics, which was our like uh the the uh what was we studied for that particular program uh and then obviously we had a shit ton of math uh but then i actually studied a lot of english and uh, that kind of stuff and we touched a little bit on history and uh that kind of stuff primary is the worst yeah yeah i guess you think that uh, and uh, I, I were kind of tired of uh, school when I stopped and then I I uh, like uh, studied nature science and the nature science program is one of those programs that prepares you for uh, college or university uh, so th those are actually like pretty much like uh, primary school you, you read pre pretty much the same subjects but it's a step up from that. Uh, because I hate studying German. I don't get it. Yeah, I, I actually studied German as well. Uh, I, I studied German from... We start touching on it on, in the sixth grade when I was uh, 12. And uh, then we uh, studied German uh, seventh, eighth and ninth grade. And there actually 
when we were in uh, high school. I haven't moved since sixth grade. I am now ninth. Yeah. So you've been uh, studying the same uh, school all the time. I'm actually still in my hometown as well. Uh, but yeah, I, I started, and then actually in high in uh, college, as I were going to say, I studied uh, German the first two years. But the problem I had was that when I studied German in uh, college, or, or no, it wasn't college, high school, I mean, uh, when I studied German there, I, I, I was so far behind because our German teacher that we had, she was actually from Germany. There's a lot of trouble kids. Oh, sorry about that. That, that, that kind of sucks. But we, we had a, a bit of trouble kids in our school as well. But, but the German teacher that I had in uh, like the last three years smoke and drink oh that's not good 15 the drink already at 15 jesus christ i actually didn't drink a single drop of alcohol until i was 17 and like nine months or something i, I was almost 18 and uh according to the law here in sweden we can't drink alcohol under the year of 18 and uh, when you are 18, you can only drink alcohol when you're out and about on a pub or in a restaurant and that kind of stuff. You can't bring alcohol home. Because if you're gonna go to uh, uh, the specific store that sells alcohol, because in Sweden we have to go to a special store that sells alcohol. Uh, and that, then you have to be 20. Uh, one of them robbed the house uh, last years uh but got away oh because of age oh damn oh shit i'm reading chat too much he stole an air gun jesus and a hatchet oh that that's not good what well, what did he plan to do with those I really hope uh, like that he didn't do any special with the air gun and hatchet. Here we do a lot of hunting. Okay. So he did use it for hunting. To fight immigrants. Yeah, you have a lot of uh, problem with I immigrants in uh, Bosnia or Bosnia. But yeah, uh, actually about about, uh, about drinking in uh, Bosnia. What are the rules for for drinking uh, in Bosnia? I know that like in Germany, isn't isn't it like uh, sixteen or something? If people are coming from Syria and, and stealing, uh, uh, I guess you were just right stuff. These the stole my mom's. Oh, that sucks. Uh. My mom actually also got her phone uh, stolen in the subway like half a year ago or something. That that, that, that kind of sucks so so bad because that there's that there isn't really when when they stole stole their phone like uh, in a subway like that there there isn't really much that a, the police can do. Which sucks is so bad. You can't drink before 18, but that that's just on paper. Yeah, uh, I guess that's kind of uh, how it is in Sweden as well. Please suck, yeah. That That's kind of bad. In, in Sweden, uh, it, it's a problem. The police, 
might be good and, and they, they have good intentions but but they are kind of like they aren't allowed to do enough to like protect the law and order I, I think that the police should be allowed to do a lot more like if you compare it with American police the American police is a lot more like they are a lot more harsh when they do uh, certain things and like when when the police in America do a like just a regular like a roadside stop when they stop a vehicle when they walk up to the vehicle they are already gonna have their hands on the gun that they had because of that they have so many problems with police shootings in America and that kind of doesn't happen in Sweden because uh, always when the police shoot somebody they they like uh, it's it is in media for like a shit ton of while I was told that a policeman uh, spot a kid a bear in a bar what wait 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 what I need to read this more clear I was told that a policeman bought a kid a bear in a bar that kid flexed a beer beer oh okay sorry about <laughs> sorry sorry about that uh oh uh, shit that that's not good that, that that that's actually really that that's really that that that's really bad i mean come on that that is a police that that, that policeman is like he doesn't even try to do a good job, does he? That that that's just that that should be just a big no no. That that a police should never, especially if it, I guess a a police shouldn't really be in a bar. From the beginning unless they are gonna remove a person that is like too drunk or something but a police should never like why, why would he buy a beer in a bar at all that, that that's kind of weird i guess it, the police might be there to like serve as guards in a bar to like keep, keep uh, everything uh, chill in a bar so that nobody does anything stupid. We we live in a village and everybody knows everybody. Yeah, that that then that police is uh, kind of like caught red-handed and everybody know who the police is, right? That that I I guess that's that that's pros and cons about living in a small town or a village. I I'm I, I'm actually the same. I'm I I don't know how uh, big your village is, but. I, I'm living in a quite small town in Sweden. It's like, I think it's just uh, on, on if we uh, like think about the a little bit of outside the town as well. It's like a hundred thousand citizens or something. So it, it's a fairly small town, uh, but I, I I'm actually brought up. Uh, Oh shit, 1,000 residents. That, that is really small. That, then I really understand why everybody knows everybody. And I guess the, words go, the word goes around quite fast, doesn't it? Th this, is actually, this is actually what I love with streaming. Because you are from uh, Bosnia, right? And I'm from Sweden. And, and we can like talk like this and like compare differences in our countries and cultures and, and I think that's amazing because I learn I learn a shit ton about Bosnia right now which is amazing and uh, I guess you can learn a little bit about Sweden when I uh, like compare the stuff so so this is just that, that's just amazing about having a com community that I want to build up right now uh, but yeah I, I'm brought up uh, just outside of this town like uh, 
18 kilometers outside of this town. On the countryside. And I, I oh shit, I, I've messed up. I haven't followed the GPS, Jesus Christ. Uh, but yeah. Uh... Uh, uh, so I, I'm I'm actually brought up uh, pretty much by the sea. I, I'm living on the uh, east coast of Sweden, uh, just north of Stockholm. So uh, I've brought up with I'm brought up with boats and all of that kind of stuff as well. In my village, la uh, last month there were pro protests. Okay. What were they protesting about, if you don't mind me asking? Oh, they didn't want to mine. Okay. What, what kind of uh, resources were, were they going to mine? Ecology, yeah, yeah, I, I guess I can kind of understand that. They, they are talking about uh, that in Sweden as well, and to open up uh, uh, some, I think it was iron mines, uh, in some, some cities like further down south, and uh, that was not appreciated as, as well. And I can uh, lithium. Yeah, I guess I guess mining is, is just just such a big business. It's gonna take up uh, such a big space. Uh, there, there is a town pretty far up north in Sweden that is called Kiruna, uh, and uh, that town below that town. It has always been a mine, but they have dug out that mine so badly, so uh, the town, the the like ground is on a risk of actually breaking and bring the town down into the mine. So they are actually working on right now, uh, working on moving the whole town, which I think is kind of crazy. So a lot of stores and kind of stuff uh, has to close and uh, move move location. So th that that that's kind of the bad side, the back side of what a mine or a mining industry can do to a town. And, and that that is just that that is just so bad. It's just terrible. Let's take off here. <laughs> if you're a pro, pro run, uh, you better run. Yeah. I I don't mind mind when you need a mine if you really find a good location, but but it shouldn't like be bad for the citizens. You, you really need a uh, fucking help. You really need to find a good location for to have the mine. That, that And uh, I would be pro mine and mining industry if it is in the correct like uh, location. The Dutch of Lloyd. <laughs> uh, welcome Norup. So about my Minecraft house. <laughs> okay. Things happen, yeah. They sure did. I I have actually not been in into the server yet. 
Did you find out what the problem was uh, on the server? But they they refused. So are are they gonna build the mine in uh, your town, or did they successfully prevent the mine from uh, being built? Nether had crashed. Okay. No, okay. Th this fucking gear stick is slipping off the table. But I, I, I guess it is because it's partially on the mouse pad. Why are we talking about mice? Because uh, in uh, B05 uh, KO. Uh, his uh, hometown uh, apparently had they were apparently going to build a mine in his hometown the company was called uh, Rio Tinto and they worked with local company called uh, Medini Brijeg sorry about butchering that name it means honey mountain okay oh fuck it I'm just gonna I need another gear. Oh, we've actually reached the location. I am going to switch truck after this mission just so that we can get a truck that has a regular trailer because I'm. I just fucking hate these dolly trailers. It's just the worst fucking thing ever. <clears throat> okay, let's do this. It, I think it's kind of bad though that when you have these dollar trailers, even though I suck at reversing with them, I, I think that you should be able to choose the complicated reversing like, like the, this one I just need to run around and like just go straight in and place the trailer so it isn't really a challenge to do There we go. No, but seriously, nothing has happened to your house. Uh, okay. I kind of hope it hadn't, because I'm kind of happy with that house. But you were talking about, uh, like, traps and shit, which is kind of uh, making me a little bit worried but what there shouldn't be a but right there mm -hmm. what about nether is it still fucked up Let's get into another truck. Uh, preferably a Scania. Maybe a bit. No, not this one. That's a Volvo. This one then. What's this? That's a boring one. We want a big Scania. Preferably an a Scania though with three rear axles. Oh, okay, we have to restart. Okay, that. That's not bad. I guess it could be worse. Um, let's choose one of the 
we can do this truck anyways ju and just uh, race the uh, middle axle. What about Nya? Absolute. Uh, okay, so that one does have a trailer. Okay, so so I don't really know if you hear this in the microphone. But outside of my apartment right now, the fucking ice cream truck is there. Why do you have an ice cream truck 3rd of March? It's cold outside, come on. Well, it could be worse, but it's still no good. But, well, we hadn't done that much in Nether anyways, had we? Or had you bu built, like, even more than uh, that portal room in Nether? We're gonna drive this truck. I will watch the stream. Yeah, that's awesome. But I won't write. Uh, no worries. As long as you enjoy the stream, I will enjoy having you here. That's amazing. I have to do something. Yep. You know what? I, I usually watch streams when I uh, game on my free time as well. So uh, just uh, have fun and enjoy. Uh, so yeah. Oh fuck, we have the bad gearbox. Okay, so that is something that we need to change straight away. I hate this gearbox. Because... Thanks to like the C1 and C2 gear, uh, it complicates a lot uh, about uh, like how I choose between the gears. Because uh, to reach gear 12 right now, I need to use two buttons. But with the gearbox that we will uh, like change to right now, uh, I will only need to uh, I will only need uh, to use one button to to like switch the range. Is this me, me padre? Excuse me? Something is your dad? I don't really know Spanish. Oh fuck, we can almost... Can we start? How is that fifth gear? Oh, okay. See if we can start in fifth gear. I'm studying in Spanish right now. Why do you study Spanish? We haven't go going see so that. <laughs> yeah, that it was a long ways. It was long ago that we actually needed to study a secondary language. Or well, I guess a third language. Let's go in here to Scania. Shouldn't like Scania be in Sardinia? Or do, you, or do you like? Uh, do you like need to have a third language studying uh, for? Oh, you, you do need uh, to study a third language for your, uh, like, program that you're taking right now. Oh, nice. I, I didn't, I did actually not know that. I need to take this real quick, so let's uh, take a quick break.
Thank you. Uh, so what I was saying was like, why do you, why the fact do you need to take so uh, many Spanish courses? I only had up to like four. On my school that I had in uh, like, I guess you can call it high school or what, upper secondary. We only had up to four, or we had up to five, but but uh, that was like an extra course that you needed to take. Uh, should we run with? No, we should not run with our own trailer. Fuck that. Uh, let's go into freight market instead. Choose our city. Uh, or should we actually not? Choose a city and uh, maybe choose something with a special mission. Fuck that. Um, okay, so you're gonna do the like college level as well. Uh, I guess we can do a tiny mission down to Poland. Let's do price per distance. Prague, Jesus Christ, that's a long mission. Okay. Uh, that makes a lot more sense. Uh, but why the fuck do you need to do the college level as well? Yeah, yeah, I do get it, but like... Her school, uh, that's a new thing. <laughs> uh, yeah, okay. So let, let's actually do this. We need to change the new... Actually choose a new mission. Uh, nobody's here. Thank you. Let's go and pick up the mission. It's so much more nicer that I just had one one button that you need to press to change between the ranges. I guess you can call it like I only have high gears and low gears right now. I only need up to five. I only, I only needed to do up to four. Yeah, I know that you're like a study, study holic or something, and I don't get it. You were the one that got me into gaming and like stopped studying shit. And now you're the one that is studying shit. That is the better gamer as well. What the fuck? <laughs> Just the English shit. Well, the English I actually studied up to seven. And that, that is something that I never regret. Yeah, like... Up to four was the... Or well, uh, to to be honest, the required one when we were in high school was like three, but I to get get some uh, like additional points, uh, I chose to continue studying uh, the uh, third third language level four as well. I think it was that one I chose. Yeah. 
Yes, it is. So, so level four even is not required. I, I don't, I don't even know why I chose that one, because that was fucking stupid of me. Yoppe, what's up? Welcome. How are we doing tonight? Hope you're doing well. But, but why I like studying is because I have so fucking easy to learn. Yeah, and that that is. That, that is just not okay. Okay, we can drive in here as well. Th this is the way out, but I'm just stupid. Good, that's good. Nice, nice, nice. Well, welcome to the stream. Now we need to reverse down to the trigger here so that we can pick up the mission. Okay, front market. Uh, there we got our mission. Oh, it looks like we are gonna get a short trailer. And this fucking gear stick. And that might be why I'm kind of good at games as well. Yeah, I suppose. And it. If I'm gonna need to learn something, I need to work my ass off to actually learn anything. And that's why I'm never gonna be a good gamer and like need to be like really fucking passionate about something if I need, if I want to get good at it. I guess I could become, become fairly good if I wanna... Oh shit, missed the gear. There we go. If I wanna drive like big vehicles like trucks and shit. Because that, that is something that I kind of like. Oh fuck, we need to sleep soon as well. Or not. Nah. You're, you're good at understanding games. Are you really sure about that? This stream was lagging for a while, but I found out why. I was just... Dude, you're downloading the game on a poopy line. What? Next to YouTube. What the? F okay, there. Can I actually? Which one is Joseph? That. Oh, there we go. Some games. Yeah, well. I guess simulator games. I'm. Uh, Kind of okay at understanding. Okay, we, we have actually p picked up the trailer right now, so let's go. Now we can actually get going and on the roads, mate. <clears throat> there we go. You know, farm. Yeah, well, it, it's a. Yeah, that's a game. Your truck is also a game. Well, well, to be honest, Farming Simulator is is more a game rather than a simulator. Oh, Jesus fucking Christ. No, download games and watching streams. Uh, that can be a hard time if you don't... It, do you have a mobile network or is it a landline uh, network? I mean, if you have a uh, network that is based on landline, it should be uh, working. No problem for you now. You're, yeah, but your your landline uh, networks is fucking insane. Like like the gamer that you are, obviously you're choosing a fairly high level of landline network. What, why? Oh shit, I didn't choose. Oh, you are running a landline oh. network. Maybe you are running the same uh, landline... Uh, landline uh, network that I run. Like the uh, same level.
<clears throat> you. Joppe. Norup uh, runs a lot better in the ne landline network than I do. I think that he runs like... I, I run 100. Uh... Yeah, you nor doesn't you have like uh, a two fifty network or something or five hundred or whatever, whatever it is eight hundred? Are you fucking crazy? That that that's just mad. But I guess I stream sometimes, and uh, then most of the time I just watch like Netflix or some shit, so I don't really need eight hundred. For me personally, I would never use uh, all, up all the power that 800 would give me. Only thing would be if I would like fucking uh, download big uh, games or something. Like, like one game that I were like thinking about playing was uh, the Ark Survival Evolved, and. Uh, but that game's fucking huge. That that was like uh, 220 or no no, the fuck uh, worse, 125 gigs or something. Yeah, that 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 is uh, that that that's a big part in uh, living like in a relationship and living together that you can split the cost and of uh, that kind of stuff. Ooh. And uh, that really gives you the opportunity of uh, getting better stuff like that. So that's a huge pro of uh, living together. Yeah, no, I can kind of fucking understand that you you would not pay for it yourself. Um, that is in Poland, so we need to go to Gdansk. I think at least. Yeah, we need to go here, I believe. Or did we? I don't fucking remember. Let's go to Poland and hope for the best. Maybe I've fucked up bad right now. I don't know. But we will see. Uh. Oh, jeez. Okay, let's go. Let's do this. Oh no, we actually don't need blinkers here. The fuck am I doing? Uh, 500 and oh crap. Guys, I think I fucked up. Oh, I fucked up bad. Oh my god! <laughs> Oh no, I, I did choose the wrong one. Oh my god, we need to we, we need to turn around somewhere. I need to like go up to this This way over here and do like a u-turn or something Can I even do a u-turn here? Oh, uh, yeah, we can If we're a little bit careful Because I am not gonna drive 508 kilometers. We're gonna be crazy late with this mission, but holy shit. We need to get back in. Oh my god. Can we can we even run to Oh fuck, this is not gonna go well. Fuck off. Oh, no. <laughs> Honestly, I think it might go fucking faster if we actually drive the distance. Let, let, let's check the map. Uh, fuck, I've done... I've done a real fucking oopsie. <laughs> oh, no. Honestly, let's... Let's... 
Oh fuck, I don't know what to do. This were just going to be a quickie! I'm not gonna get a penny for this mission! Fucking hell. <laughs> oh no, but I honestly... That, that's, that journey is gonna be like 19 hours. Well, it's going to take like two hours to drive that distance, you know. Oh my god. Oh. Well, either way, I'm not going to get a penny because we're going to get crap late. So we might as well fucking drive it. It's 12 hours remaining on this mission. How long would it actually take to drive that distance though? That is something that I want to know right now. So let's do another U-turn here. So we actually... It would take 8.32. So we would actually make it in time. So, so I think it's going to be more... There's nothing we can do. We, we have to drive the distance if we want to have money for this mission. So I guess it's just getting out on the roads. But we might need to sleep on the road, and if we need to sleep on the road, we're fucked. How far... Okay, we're just gonna make it when it comes to rest as well, so... Uh, I think this is a fucking no-brainer. We have to drive it. It's gonna take, like, one or two hours, but... Ah, uh, we can make it. There we go. Let's get out on the road and get going. But I'm gonna get fucking out of stuff to say though. And talk about it. So that's gonna be uh, kind of bad shit. I'm already out of stuff to talk about. Oh, we're gonna tip our wood. Yeah, 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 right. But it is gonna be a good game. If I can get there in time. There's probably gonna be some kind of fucking roadblocks and that kind of shit as well. To just completely fuck me over. That, that has happened so many times in this game that, that you, you you think that I like I, I'm just barely gonna get this in time and uh, yeah but you can see that you will make it but what the fuck were you talking about in my chat if the, if it was not about my game but anyway anyways it has happened so many times that you like think that you're gonna make it but just barely and then you come up to a fucking roadblock and you're fucked oh no now we stop sometimes oh fuck i need to build six more floors on my chest room okay i missed that part and i while right reading chat i actually crashed my truck as well this is not going well, guys. <clears throat> so you need to... How can you have... How can you have enough stuff for six fucking more floors? Come on! <laughs> I guess we're gonna have to end the stream by going and checking out the stream. Or the server, I mean. But we might, might, we might have to do that. I play the game. Well, I also play the game, but I guess you do a lot more discovering and like exploring and shit and exploring new shit. You, you're a lot more in the nether and like the end and that kind of stuff 
more than me. I usually don't go to Nether and then I can sell that much. Unless I need like quartz or something. Because if I need quartz, I need to go to Nether, obviously. This is only in Nether that you can actually get quartz. And quartz you actually need for some uh, redstone uh, like shit. Like the. Uh, what are they called? The, the fucking. Uh, what are they called? No, help me. Those that discover block updates. What are they called? I can't fucking remember. Oh, for fuck's sake, get, get him, move on. Move out of my way. Why isn't it put in gear? Okay, now everything is fucked up with the gear ratios. Come on. Drive a Piotr over 21 grand. Amazing. That's kind of what's good when you get going and uh, you get the shit going. So you actually get some uh, employees that can drive for you as well. Just we are on the same track. Wait, wait, wait. Are you saying horse or... I haven't seen horse at any time, I think. Or did I do that? I'm confused. Did I really do that? I don't think horse is a a word that I would use at any time. Because yes you You need to go to another Well what what the fuck? You need to go to nether to get horse. Like what? I'm still confused. Lol, lol on yourself. Fuck off. Are you just writing that to confuse me? I didn't know yet that you could get horse in uh, like nether. Am I even gonna get banned? Am I like gonna get banned for using that word? Like in comparison on how you're like writing it in chat. That's what you said. Like what? What? What the fuck? I didn't. I didn't say anything about horse. I said quartz. Cords! Oh no! Oh fuck! Cords! Not whores! Cords! Fucking hell! I guess you hear what you wanna hear. Is there nothing? Do I actually need to pay something here? No? Yeah, I. Oh fuck! <laughs> you talk like a homeless. Well, you can fuck off. Oh, okay, so my engine is fucked. Well, this was... Oh, no, now I, now I get a car behind me. <laughs> No, sorry, but okay. Of course, yeah, that that was what I said. Not horse. As I said, I get. I guess you hear what you want to hear. Let's see if I can turn around here. No, now I'm with you. Yeah, well, it should have been from the get go. Oh come on. I should have taken the boat. Keep telling the story. Uh, I forgot the story. 
Oh, come on! The, this fucking truck sucks! I'm stuck. I, I think I need to reverse all the way and the cars have to move. Because this is fucking up my engine. Oh, no! Now we got a fucking car there as well! Come on! No! Is he gonna drive through? Now I'm really fucking stuck. <laughs> Oh, can, can I actually run through here while he is there? No! No! Fuck! Come on! Oh, no! No! Can I actually... Ooh, this, this might work. We're gonna... My friends! This is not how you should do it! This is not how you should drive! <laughs> well, the cars didn't really move, so... I guess it's all on them. Let's use the second gear. So, this part of the... This part of our like little journey was kind of a... A uh, mess up, and I guess now is the moment where you should take back what you said about I know about I I like know about some games because this was kind of the biggest fucking fail that I've ever done I think. Oh maybe not. Uh, maybe the off ramp that I did a while ago. When I almost missed it and like flew. Worse is not my speciality either because I always fuck them up. Checking my documents. Don't, please don't. Jesus. Oh, they, they actually took the fake documents. Nice. Never have had that happen before. Now I can get going again. Let, let, how about let's not crash again? Okay, so we need to do this one. Oh my god! Do I need to sleep anything? No. Then I suggest we're just gonna get going as fast as we can. I'm gonna have to be there and I guess we can do this one. I have to... I'm gonna be there in like six hours. And there our engine fucked up. We're gonna be there in about six hours. But we're gonna have to be there in ten hours, so we are we are actually doing fairly well on time so far, even though we did that little mishap, if you will. Um, but I think we can make this work. There we go. And let's do that. Okay. We can do this. Damn, we got over 300, almost 400 kilometers left to go. Oh. Get into gear. Is that even the real distance that, that it would take to, like, go on this journey? It feels like 36 metrical miles is a little bit short to go this distance. But maybe it is actually a proper, like, the proper distance that it would take. But then again, the the cities and towns in this game is a lot smaller than they would be 
in uh, real life. Like Stockholm is like the size of his like village pretty much. But then again, Stockholm looks bigger, but you can't really access all the parents of Stockholm. Uh, you can only like access the parts where you got the industries and the industrial part of Stockholm. All right, red lights. Let's get us ourselves a little bit of a drink. We're only going straight so we can start going straight away when it gets green. Come on, let's get a green light. Am I seriously going to be able to pour myself a drink in the weight of this red light here? Mm -hmm. Even got a bit of a sip of that drink. A sip of the drink. Oh fuck, I, I watched the, the uh, wrong red light. What the fuck?! Okay, I drove on the wrong one as well. Well, now we have like uh, gone by a red light. I know that my driving kind of, kind of pretty much looks like I fucking don't have a driver's license, <laughs> but I promise, I don't suck this bad this bad in real life. I don't. I I don't really know what fucking happens when I play this game. I need a bigger screen. It would be like, be nice to have the Samsung screen. That is ultra wide. I, I reckon that one would, would be perfect for uh, this kind of a game. So that you get a lot wider of a view. It would be awesome to. Oh, for fuck's sake. It would be awesome to play uh, simulator games on that screen. Oh, it's gonna be red. Oh, fucking hell. I like how I need to put my knee through the table so that I don't slide back in my chair. Because the brake is so stiff on, on this like steering wheel system. So uh, if I would press without like putting my knee to the table, I would actually be pushed back. But I guess I the best way best setup would be a stiff chair that is like mounted to the floor or something. I guess it would be kind of nice to have a chair that is a simulating system. Those like racing chair. Those racing chairs are like is like mounted on a on a frame. Where you can mount your pedals and steering wheel as well. Some of them even have a mount for the screen. But that I guess that, that wouldn't even fit in this room. Because the room I'm sitting in is pretty fucking small. With, with how I have my setup right now. Uh, I barely fit my chair actually. Because of the uh, like locker that I have behind me. But you can't see it in the screen right now. Because it's out of frame for the cam. No. There you go. That's actually a problem that I have, haven't had for a good while. That the gears aren't really slipping in correctly. I don't really know if it is because I pushed down on the gear stick. A little bit or something to go in like reverse mode or something but it shouldn't really be a problem I, I don't think maybe it is uh, that I'm not pu pushing down the clutch enough okay so we're gonna turn off here let's go seventh gear I think that's gonna be good enough that works We have actually done quite well on the distance.
And we're actually down two hours from our little mishap. So this this has actually gone a little bit faster than I thought it would. I guess it would be better to keep the eleventh gear in so we can get a little bit of a like gear break. Do you like call, call it gear break or like engine break or what the fuck is this called in English? I actually don't know. Ooh, I guess that was was a little bit bad. I guess you call it an engine break in English as well. That's something that I love with manual vehicles, that it actually can uh, use the engine brake rather than using the regular brake to, like, maintain the speed a little bit. Because when, uh, in my, like, real life car that I drive right now, it's an automatic gearbox. And uh, you don't really have that availability of a engine ring you can use it a little bit because it's a like four step gearbox i can you do it on my uh, my like uh, gear stick put it in a mode where i can choose a little bit but i don't think that's too good for the uh, automatic gearbox to uh, use that too much but again, with like six gears on a uh, manual car, you can fine tune it a lot better. And you're gonna know the car a lot better what when you need a certain gear. We're gonna go for him. But yeah, you have a, a manual car, right? That car is actually really nice. And it was in such a good shape when uh, you bought it. Or I, I assume that it is... Uh... Yeah, that, uh, that, that sixth gear is actually really fucking useful to get the revs down. Because that, that is gonna bring down the, like, fuel usage quite a lot, actually, when you're, like, up to speed. And that that's partially the reason for why it's so fuel efficient. Yeah, just give you a new viewpoint. The viewpoints, that's actually something new that they have uh, implemented in the game. I haven't seen that. Oh, she's... We need to go here. I guess it could go through... Through that checkpoint or whatever you want to call it as well. But I don't really want to do that. Especially not if I can... Oh, fuck, 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 fuck. Almost did it again. Fuck. <laughs> uh, okay. Come on, we're gonna do this. Sneak over a little bit like that. Check our documents and... Just, just let me through. You know that I'm a good person. You don't... You know that I have everything in order. I actually m might get... Oh, I didn't get... Oh, it's only on the roadside checks that you are gonna get uh, fined for if the truck isn't in order. So those, like, weighing stops, you're actually gonna get fined if the truck is broken. Which we are gonna be beat if we are gonna pass one of those. It's just to hope that we don't... Why am I driving a... Oh, for fuck's sake. I I'm fucking up too much tonight. What is the... What's wrong with me tonight? This is not... This is 
not how bad I usually drive. This is a lot worse than I usually do. We're not gonna do the same mistake again. You see? You see? Guys, I'm learning. I'm learning. That's a lot better. So, how many times are you gonna fucking get your papers checked? Mm -hmm. There we go. There we go. Now we're not over speeding anymore either. <clears throat> oh, for fuck's sake. We need to fix this truck. Or we will just cho choose a new truck from the list of the trucks that we own and let our employees fix the trucks. I think that's how it works, at least. Actually, in the turn, we're going to use the engine brake again. I guess we could have put it to 10th gear, actually. Bring down the gear so we can maintain the speed a little bit better. Come on. Don't want to lose any more speed. Nicely done. Yeah, that iron farm actually doesn't produce nearly as much as I would have wanted to. Yeah, I already know that it sucks and I hate it. I, I need to find like a better design of an iron farm because uh, as you said yourself, that, that one does really fucking suck. And I, I really don't like it either. It's, it's like when I last checked it I don't even know what it was last I checked it I don't think it's on I, honestly to be honest I, I don't think it's gonna be above 15 is it even gonna be above 10 in produced iron I don't think it is honestly It's going to be around 10, I would imagine. Maybe. If we're lucky. It isn't! Nice! That is a lot better than I thought. What is it on? Well, I guess it's... Because... Or 40? Oh, that's a lot better than I thought. Uh, yeah, well, you don't need to be exact. That is a lot better than I thought it would. Oh, come on, get it in gear. Uh, but yeah, it, it, even though it's better than I thought it would, it still sucks. Because they, it was that design was advertised as... 300 fucking iron bars an hour and uh, that one has been uh, like it hasn't even been nearly it should be on 213 by now how did you math that Uh, well, I guess it should. But it, I mean, yeah. Uh, but I mean, 
the reason why it sucks is it, it could potentially produce that much, but the reason for that is because the spawning like iron golems aren't spawning where we want them to spawn. They they are like fucking spawning uh, under the iron farm. I wonder what would happen if we would move the iron farm down a bit. Okay, this is not good. That's what I want. I wonder what would happen with the iron farm. I'm actually gonna try that. Build blocks. Yeah. Okay. I I'm not. I'm not gonna map that because I'm lazy. But oh fuck, we're not gonna go there. That that's the wrong one. Yeah, that that absolutely sucks. But but I'm gonna try when I get in. I'm actually gonna get in soon, I think. Just for fun. Probably after this mission. Oh no. Uh, and I'm gonna try to uh, put blocks below the farm. Uh, now we need to kill off the golems that they have spawned below the farm. And hopefully that is gonna do something just different. I don't really know why they told me to build the fucking farm that high up. Oh no. Okay. I trust your math skills. By now you're probably actually much better than me on math. Because I don't practice math anymore. Fuck that speed camera. Yeah, no. I'm, g I'm gonna try my solution and see what happens. Oh, fuck you. Hopefully we can solve something. Oh, no, 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 fuck off. Well, I guess it's only 70 here, so. Yeah, well, it's producing something at least, which is good. It was a fucking bitch to build. Oh my god. That, that's my fault. Oh my god. Oh, there we go. I would really hope that my solution would work because I'm gonna need a shit ton of iron. If I'm gonna be able to build a chest system. Because I'm all, all the fucking hoppers and shit. 0.17 an hour, that's not good. That is uh, pretty far off from 300 an hour. Well, I guess I saw it working in the video, so I don't really know what fucked up in my design. But, well, that's kind of why I'm calling myself the worst gamer in history, because... No... Because even though I follow descriptions and shit to the T, like, doing exactly what they are fucking doing, there's always something that is gonna fuck up for me. That never happens to other people. You happen. Well, fuck off. Well, guys, I thought it would. 
I, I didn't think it would take or like go this fast but we have actually reached our location and uh, like just for fun we're gonna make this into a tutorial mission and it's probably gonna be edited down and become a YouTube video later so we're actually gonna talk a little bit about how to reverse with a truck and trailer which is fun in my opinion so we're gonna look okay so this is a perfect uh, location it's gonna be an easy reverse but honestly it's because the golem is spawning outside yeah we need to fix that somehow uh, I'm gonna try to uh, put blocks behind below the farm and uh, try to force them like up a little bit we're gonna see if that works so yeah tutor tutorial how to reverse with a truck and trailer so the first tip I would like to give we're we're gonna reverse into the left of us over here uh, over there okay good we know our location so the first part is like lining up the reversing so what we're gonna do is that we're gonna turn right here we see our location kind of behind us we're gonna actually have it checked that's a terrible lining up so we're gonna have to turn a little bit like this and then the best tip right now is to straighten out so you have it so you start to reverse with a straight trailer like this and uh, then you're gonna lean out the window reversing to the left is always gonna be easier because in this case we can lean out of the window if I would look to the right in the truck oh for fuck's sake engine malfunction again over here I can't see what happens or I can see it very badly even though we have the cheating uh, rear view mirror on the back on the right side so yeah we're gonna start by reversing get it get it into the reversing gear and now if I want a trailer to go to the left of the truck I need to turn the steering wheel to the right that's gonna pull the trailer to the left because if you think about it one trick that you can use is to think about it like if you were pushing the trailer yourself so now I need to pull so I need the trailer to start to travel to the left of the truck I need to pull the the steering wheel a little bit to the right but then what you also need to do is to catch the falling of the trailer so I'm gonna start pull pull the steering wheel to the left to straighten out a little bit now we need to pull it to the right and uh, now we can travel now I want the rear views of the trailers kind of to be lined up with the edge of our, our area where we need trail to be and then we just move it a little bit to the right like that and then catch everything and straighten out that's all always one thing and there we have a pretty much perfect reversing but yeah one important part is that to do as small adjustments as you can don't overturn like doing crazy shit like that if you can have a good result by just doing that that's what you need to do so you don't want to turn like crazy like that because then you're gonna need to realign the trailer several times uh, but yeah let's release the trailer and now we're actually gonna go into Minecraft because I feel like checking out the server a little bit. I haven't I haven't been in for like over a week or something. But yeah, F fucking your truck has been great again. What is that sound? I don't even know what that is. Probably my computer blowing up or something. Uh, but yeah. So we're gonna do a little bit of a game switch. What is this? Let's move it over like that. I miss my uh, stream deck. I need it. I need to get a stream deck again. You can do like I'm doing right now. Um, and uh, control your stream if you're using streamlabs 
like I'm doing right now, you can control your stream by using your phone actually. Uh, but that isn't really as convenient as using usually using the Elgato Stream Deck because the Elgato Stream Deck is a lot better in my opinion. And the another good part with using the like regular Elgato Stream Deck is that your your phone isn't going to be occupied by a Stream Deck interface. But yeah, let's get into Minecraft. I'm not really in a position where I can buy it back right now. If I could, I would, but I need to put money in some other shit. Uh, I got shit to pay. But if we're gonna play Minecraft, we actually have to use, we have to play some music. Good, cause I'm not selling. Okay. What would you fucking suggest it then? I need to get to like extend this fucking playlist or something. Because I've used the same fucking songs for a good while right now. Yeah. And I mean, even though you're not streaming, it's actually really useful. Hopefully it catches Minecraft right now. Yes, it is. And what the fuck has happened right now? Oh. Oh. It's lagging. Oh, okay. Are you streaming now? Oh, there's some text. Okay, so our house looks fine, which I'm happy about. Uh, we really need to assess the situation with this. And I think I'm gonna use dirt instead. Instead of cobblestone, because... Cobblestone is a pain in the ass to remove, if we need to remove it. I need a fucking other chest for cobblestone. Let's put it in here. For now. It's not gonna be there forever, but here is growing shit, so let's put in these flowers. The flowers is pro probably gonna be, be going into our compost system, but not right now. Okay, we actually have some dirt in. Oh, no, 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 no. That's not gonna go there. Let's put it up here because we don't really need that right now. Okay, so let's bring a shit ton of dirt. Yes, we have a shit ton of dirt over here. So let's just bring a few stacks. And... Now we're gonna fill that area. The crazy part of this area is that... I've already like filled a pretty big part of it uh, because this area uh, from the beginning when we started to play over here was actually not uh, dirt. All of this was sand before. Uh, so yeah, <laughs> it's gonna take some serious amount of time but we're just gonna have to start doing this business. Start to fill everything in. Because I kind of want to do it out of the my mountain. To make it like melt into the environment a little bit better. And if this does work, it's going to be great. I'm going to be really, I'm going to be a happy boy about it. If it doesn't work, I don't really know what I'm going to do. It's probably going to stay here. Kit, kit. Can't this, can't this like go and move out of my way? I don't want to try to kill it either because I don't have any armor on and I definitely don't have a good enough weapon. Let's just make you move down here. 
Let's maybe do something like this. Hopefully you can't jump up here now. And we kind of hope that we're not going to have any problem with mobs either because I can see that it's starting to kind of be, become night right now. And that's not good. I don't like it. There we go. Let's just keep that area. Or not. We might need to widen it a little bit all the way to this like plantation system that we have here. <clears throat> Alright. Oh, shite. Let's get back up. So, uh, Nordup, uh, how do you like to uh, retrieve your music for your streams? Do you like uh, not have problem with DMCA? Because I'm trying to like find easy ways to get music into my streams, but not have problem with the MCA. I don't really know how that would work. Spotify. Where do you s like what 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 kind of search stuff do you use to find uh, good music? Because the what the the like playlists uh, that I found, you kind of need to. Give credit to the artists uh, to prevent yourself from uh, having problem with DMZA, and I don't really know how to do that when you're streaming. What I've done for a slam house right now is that I have like I have the uh, if you like. A command which is exclamation mark music and uh, if you use that command you you're gonna get like a link uh, to the, the clip that is playing right now but but that was actually not a requirement That was something that I just did because I wanted to be nice to the, the lad, giving some credit. Even though he has done it just to for it to stay free. Oh come on, that golem is just giving me a fucking pain in the ass right now. Where do we need to go? We need to go a little bit further. So let's fill this area. Let's go a few more blocks. Guess that might be enough. I'm a little bit worried that since that golem is alive and well that is going to prevent the villagers from spawning spawning another like golem but then again i don't really know the iron farm has actually produced some so i don't i don't know maybe this is gonna make you work better you like just move out of my way okay move up there then it isn't like preferred for me but i guess i'm gonna have to work with, with what i got don't i
<sighs> this is this is a fucking tedious work. And this this guy being in in my fucking way all the time. And I was becoming fucking annoyed as well. That is that is not preferred by me, my friends. <clears throat> and uh, I guess we, it was pretty good that we brought a full inventory of dirt because this actually has used a lot more dirt than I anticipated. And has become a knight as well. That's just fucking great. We're, we're gonna have to use a lot of dirt, of dirt as well to make it look a little bit nicer because if this is actually working to bring up the, up the floor to like... I would actually say that I would go up up to the glass level um, see how that is going to improve our design can you move down here because if you're going to move down here you're not going to be a pain in the ass for me thank you and that's nice as well great hopefully that got maybe it would have been good to actually save oh yeah you actually Oh, thank you. Thank fuck for that. I actually forgot to change over the game. So that is something that we might need to do. Because I don't really know if that command is going to fix it. No, it doesn't. But I will take care of it real quick. Uh, let's just me switch this one over. Minecraft. Well, there we go. What was my girl life? Okay, maybe not having that one. <clears throat> no, fuck. We removed our music. I guess we can use this one. Come on. Let's get it. Quick. I guess we can start playing. It's gonna come on soon. Soon the music is gonna be back. Is the music is gonna be is the music gonna be back soon? There we go. Well, that's more like it. It's going to be interesting to see if this actually works. Is that another golem? 
Or is this the same one? Okay, so it's, it, it is the same one. Uh, I can check the command later. Let's see which one it is to change game from the chat. I actually don't know what what command that is. It would be kind of convenient because right now how I do it is that I actually go into the Twitch home like site and go to the creator panel from there. And that is I don't think that's so convenient. It would be much easier if I could just do it from the chat. And those chats, th those like commands doesn't really show in chat, I think. Or well, they might do, who cares. I'm not too well read on those commands, to be honest. I hope that I don't fuck up the redstone block for this. Oh shit. Oh shit. Crap. That golem hopefully cr protects us a little bit. But I kind of don't want the... I kind of want to feel protected right now, but I don't want the villagers to to feel protected because that's kind of the point of that zombie that is going up and down uh, on that piston. That's kind of to make the villagers not feel safe because that's what produces the golem. That is something that we might need to look into as well. Uh, since you, you Norup, uh, found a ender port, end portal, uh, we might need to look into creating a duplicator, item dupl duplicating system. Because that is something that might be a little bit convenient to have. Because then we can... Uh, thanks to that we would be able to duplicate... Like... Emerald and that kind of stuff. Oh shit. I don't want... Oh fuck, that, that one is looking at us here. That's not good. Oh fuck. Well that didn't really go well, did it? Fucking Endermans. That was an Enderman that had walked all the way from uh, our bottom floor, or well, our cellar, I guess you could call it. And uh, then uh, gone all the way to our top floor. Oh, no, 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 what? Out of my way. Uh, the, the Iron Golem doesn't do shit for protection. Uh, I think I can cover this part up. Without disrupting the... Redstone clock. Wait a minute. Oh no, that's not good. So they have actually produced two iron golems. Oh. Can you like not? Why does he have tridents?
No! Look at enchantment lol. Uh, channeling flame, impaling five, knockback two, loyalty three, mending and breaking three. Oh jeez. Fucking get this done. I hope that this is gonna work so that we are actually going to <clears throat> get the golems to spawn on spawn on top of our like Could do that. No, your house lot. I have spelat en whole lot mycket. On you now. 
now. He does have a lake house now. Okay, so we're walking, walking in this part. I guess we can do that. Okay, so we're gonna take a, oh fucking hell. So we're gonna take a little tour of, well, Nordic Pass down today. We're gonna have a seat hit. I guess we can go. And we're gonna need to break this as fast as possible. Because if we don't, he might crash into it. Oh! What the fuck was that? Uh. No, no, no! Well, he was fast. Uh, okay. So, what, what, what are we gonna... Where... To... And these fucking block flame shit. So annoying to have a chat to... Oh, sh oh shite! There we go. Can I, can I climb faster? No. How fucking high is this? Like shit. This is fucking crazy. So shit on Instagram as well. Well, how? How fucking much is it lagging up here? Oh, he actually successfully did it. Uh, no! Da -da! Oh, come the fuck on! How the fuck am I gonna do this? Uh! Fuck yes. Uh, okay. Crazy cat dude. Right, okay. So this is kind of the area that we have already seen, I suppose. Fireplace, nice, nice. Nice. This is second li- Well, everybody needs a second living room, don't they? And this is? Uh 
Okay, where to next? I guess we're gonna follow him up a hit. Well. Why do you have... Okay, we're gonna just... Hey. Bedroom. You never sleep. Oh, I can fucking eat it up here. I can break shit up here. I wouldn't need more to drink. Did you change anything? Oh, that's just stopping. Huh. Oh, fuck. Uh. Be. Cows. I. Could. Eat. I should not. I know I can't break anything. No. Wait. Is fucking weird. Are you going up again? Oh, that is a fucking staircase a bit. Well, this is nice. Very nice, very nice. You don't want to know how long it can take with a village, just thing. It takes fucking ages. Uh, okay, so this is some outside fucking shit. Just with two? Okay. I don't know. Uh, okay. Rest don't take that long. Okay. Color changing. 
Uh, the air gun. Oh, crap. That's fucking epic. I, I fucking hate these ph phantoms. We're probably gonna be attacked by them as well. They're fucking huge. Why hasn't he placed... Well, this goes around and around. Oh, okay. So this is kind of the system of color changing. Oh, so that's how you can color change it. Choppy Poopy, thank you for the follow. Smart design. So what we're doing, since you're new here, what we are doing right now is that we are taking a tour of Norp's house. So this is his kind of color changing beacon. That's nice. And welcome to the community. <clears throat> so yeah. Do what he, where he takes us next, next time. Nice, nice, yeah, I completely agree. No, he's gonna fucking. There we go. He didn't lock us in. He could if he would. Because we can't really use any le levers or pressure plates or anything in this house. Because he has a. That rest is epic. Well, it's actually not that co complicated. It's basically a redstone clock that is uh, making the redstone single completing. Or like repeating I mean uh, and then uh, the piston system that like changes around the uh, uh, glass uh, box it's actually not that complicated but it looks nice and uh, get it uh, gets a pretty cool effect when you like change the effects of the beacon it's better nice but the oh it's the chest system yeah, and this chest system is fucking huge. He has talked about that he needs to, like, add six fucking floors more. So, uh, Joppy Poopy, I guess you know, your place, uh, you, that you play Minecraft as well? And if you do, what? Quick question. What is the most annoying thing that you know of in all of Minecraft? Alternating bacon colors are always awesome. Yeah, yeah I do. I, yeah, I kind of assume since you are in the category of Minecraft. Uh, gravel for sure. <laughs> well, I couldn't agree more because or I don't know. The phantom is pretty fucking important because, or annoying because uh, those are flying bosses and I have a problem to hit them sometimes. But but you can like pre prevent them from coming if you actually go to sleep. Uh, this will be the next level. Well, this chest system is fucking next level oh and my spelling is my spelling is fucking oh yeah phantom for sure yeah yeah you, you agree me will be with me on that one but yeah, i mean apparently it is if you don't sleep in in uh, three days that's when they are coming so as long as you s sleep before that you're not gonna have a problem with the phantoms 
But then again, you ha you need to have the opportunity to be able to sleep. Like Nord that I'm playing with right now. Uh, he doesn't like to sleep in this fucking game. So when we play with him on the server, uh, we are basically never sleeping. Okay, so this is his up his upgraded farm, which is uh, th this is a little bigger than he had. <laughs> Look at four. <laughs> Color changing. How? What the fuck? The fucking color changing cheap. That shouldn't be so. What? Is that a? Has he like a plug into the game or? Or like, is that a fucking thing that he can do? Like, what the fuck? I'm Minecraft veteran. Yeah, well, I guess he is. He, like, started playing fucking 15 years ago ago, or something. How? What the fuck? Now, if you name a, a name a name tag, I jump and give it to... Okay. Come look, come look horse. Well, fucking derp horse. That that is the fuck. It's a funny easter. Egg. Yeah, I know. But, but that that is the fucking funniest like thing in uh, Family Guy. If you have watched that, the like stupid or retarded horse. That is just the funniest fucking thing ever. I just love that fucking clip. But yeah. Did he ask her? Derbo no, he didn't, didn't answer. If you name the horse uh, di dinner bone it does that. yeah oh, okay. Okay. <clears throat> I think that's kind of funny. Uh, what's like uh, with the cats, I think, uh, that if you name them a certain thing, uh, you can get them uh, like a special skin on the cat as well. Yeah. Uh, Norb just wrote that in chat as well. And here the dragon egg is... Of course. And the fuck? Show that. Oh fuck my writing. Um, oh my god. Not be there. The one of the reasons why my writing is so fucking bad right now is because I have a steering wheel that kind of blocks my keyboard so I, my position of writing is a little bit weird at the moment. But yeah. Nice. Okay, so I guess we're gonna get out of this right now, I think, or maybe, or something. How- oh, come on. How big is this? This is fucking huge! My shit isn't nearly this big. Wood for... Fucking days. <clears throat> now get out. How? I 
guess he's gonna take us to the You might oh oh okay nice nice he, he gave us an ender pearl nice let's just throw that over there and there we go nice we're out and we're back in this business hopefully i'm gonna try to sort out this uh, like iron farm uh and hopefully that's gonna make everything working and this is my house it's not nearly as big as uh, Norup's house, but Norup has actually played a lot more on this server right now than I have. And he kind of plays a lot for just uh, making everything big. I mean, if you looked, you, you saw the size of his fucking chest system. This is my system. This, these are all the chests that I need. I don't need more than this. <laughs> like fucking crazy but yeah uh actually we're, we have come to the sad time of this stream i'm gonna have to like end the stream right now but thank you guys for watching and uh, extra big thanks to win big one two three and uh, up poopy that is our new followers for this stream extra big thanks for you guys i really appreciate your following and support uh so yeah uh, hopefully you guys had had a great time because I had a fantastic time and I see you guys in a future stream Bye for now Edric's out